Hi guys, we are up from a quick little relaxation time. R&R. &R. <laughs> R &R. This is my outfit for us going to have dinner and going to the mall. So I just want it to look comfy and laid back. I'm just wearing a plain camo top, some sweats, my backpack that I had on earlier, and then some sneakers yep this is the look if you're wondering why i'm not wearing a jacket is because i didn't bring one i usually pack really good for vacation but this time i didn't do so good huh babe yeah, yeah i just like i don't know i thought of spring i was like summer feels like all summery stuff but doing fine i feel like this looks good we're not doing anything fancy so yeah hi everybody good morning sorry i didn't check in on you guys last night after i showed you guys my outfit we went to the mall walked around bought some stuff um, i'll show a little quick haul of what i got and we had dinner at buffalo wild wings was good then we had some dessert at munchies and then we were tired and exhausted so we came back to the hotel and chilled for a little bit and then we went to sleep now it is currently 8 15 a.m sunday morning and we are about to go have some breakfast downstairs and um, then we're gonna come back and get ready for the day we have a boat ride today, which we're really excited about at the um, San Diego Harbor. And then we have to go to my parents' house in LA to um, celebrate my little sister's birthday, which is so exciting. Um, let me show you guys what I bought. I'm currently wearing one of the outfits that I got, which I love so much. I need to show you guys the full outfit. I've recently been loving like sweats joggers because they're so comfy and they look nice like as a set and um, I got one of those because like I mentioned in previous videos I didn't pack so good for this trip um, that I needed like something warm and comfy and I really like this and then I'll show you guys the rest. it's like a cute little set which I really like and it looks really good I also like what the top part says bye boys and these were on sale so I got a really good price at, for them they were from papaya I still have the tag to show you guys how much they cost okay so the pants the joggers are in a small and they were on clearance for seven bucks now for the top it's a small and it was on clearance for ten bucks which is really good for this cute little set okay now let me show you guys I showed you what I got a papaya now let me show you what I got at Charlie Roos if you guys are Charlie Roos fans are you as sad as I am that they're closing? It's so sad. But you get really good deals right now. I think everything was like 60% off, babe. Higher. 60 and higher, which is really good. So if you haven't went, go and check out what they have before they don't have anything. <laughs> okay, so the first thing is I got a pair of shoes because I love shoes. Look at these. How cute. And they came in the box. But honestly, the one I went to... Um, was such a mess like everything was just everywhere it's hard if you are seven or a size seven or a six and a half or a six so hard to find like all the other bigger sizes so easy eight nine even ten so you get lucky if you have a bigger flat anyways these are the shoes that i got how cute are these oh my god they are so cute they're gonna be so like useful for the summer 
end. These are so easy to walk in, so they're gonna look so good. Yeah, so I'm super excited about these. I wanted to find more shoes because these were only ten fifty, right, babe? Yeah. Ten fifty. So I wanted to find other shoes, but um, like I said, it was really hard to find my size, and there was a lot of people too, so I didn't want to be there all night. Okay. So so the next thing is I bought these little pair of shoes too. They're like cute little flat sandals. They're so cute. Let me just show one like this. And these were six bucks. And they look really cute on. Just something very simple when you know you're gonna walk a lot or you're gonna be out and about. Originally they were 20 bucks. And then the last few items are little accessories. Which were both two sixty, babe. Right? Yeah. So first, I got these cute sunglasses. I love sunglasses. So it was a really good price. Had I known there were like two, I probably would have bought another one because they're so cute. Oh, they kind of match with like the color I'm wearing today. So yeah, these are so cute. I didn't know if I wanted these or like these pink ones. And I asked the, the lady at the register and she liked these. She thought I looked good in these. Yeah, so these are so cute. So that's that. Okay, so the last thing is this cute little coin necklace. If you're like me that loves these little coin necklaces, which are so on trend and really cute, especially layered, they look so pretty. Uh, go to Charlotte Ruse and get yourself one because originally they were six bucks and they were down at two forty or two sixty, which is a really good price and they look really cute. So, yeah. Okay, so that was the last of the haul. Um, like I said, we're about to go downstairs to have some breakfast. I will check back with you guys when I come back because I have to get ready for the day. All right, love ya. Hey guys, I'm checking back in with you guys. I'm currently in the car. We already had breakfast. We already checked out. We packed everything. Everything's ready and good to go. Breakfast was really good, huh, babe? Yeah, it was great. It was really good. Um, now we're just excited to go on the boat ride. It should be really fun. Hopefully. Everything's been good. So sorry. Yeah, this whole vacation, every activity we've done, it's been so much fun really worth it so um we're looking forward to it and hopefully it's awesome uh i'll probably try to get in some clips of like our view the bow if i can hopefully um so yeah i'll check in with you guys then let you guys know how the whole experience was so i love you guys see you then guys look it's the disney cruise ship it's so huge but it's so pretty. I bet it's so much fun. I, we literally saw a family wearing all Disney shirts. They look so cute. This would be so much fun to go in. Guys, we're about to get on the boat. Look at these. They are so big. I'm so excited. Guys, I'm on the boat. You see that bridge over there? That's the Colorado Bridge. It looks so pretty. Direction we're going to see this on the right side and stay in the channel. That is a sea lion. Sea lions are marine mammals. They eat fish and octopus. There's a sea lion. Just leave it as best light. They're larger than sea. They have large flippers. Now we're off to the right the side. We have a military base. That's they Naval work. Air Station, North Island, California. Oh, on this side too. of the base is what's known as the Carrier, Carrier. Basin. Where large ships tie up from the Navy, the biggest ship over there, the nuclear powered aircraft carrier number 71, USS Theodore Roosevelt. It's under 1,100 feet long. That ship carries an air wing of between 70 and 80 airplanes. When it deploys, it carries uh, another type that carry uh, Marine Corps aviation units and also carry Air 7, USS Paul Hamilton. Made the Secretary of the Navy during World War of 1812. On this side of the pier, USS Portland again carries Marines. Made for the city of Portland, Oregon.
we're seeing. See if you guys like it. Guys, this is a better view of the uh, hospital boat. So cool. It is so big. Okay guys, so we walked to the little park where the midway is at, so the whole museum is so big, all the way up there, and the statue that I was talking about when I was in the ocean, look how cute it is. We saw people trying to reenact it. Yeah, it was so cute, it's such a cute picture. The people who hate on it, it really, come on. View. Hi guys, I'm back. Sorry my tongue's red. Obviously I'm having some like shaved ice. Yeah. What would you call this? Like flavored shaved ice. Uh, I got it. Um, they're having like a little farmer market at the little park that was right next to the harbor. So I got some. They had all these different types of food. It seems very lively like a lot of things to do okay so first of all the boat ride was so much fun i you know we experienced it it was fun it was an out we did an hour we were supposed to do two hours but we just kind of you know we have to drive back to my parents house to celebrate ali's birthday and it's a two-hour ride so we were kind of like you know, maybe we should start heading out early. It's currently 1244 so that we get there at a good time and we're not tired and traffic isn't heavy because San Diego has mad traffic, like crazy mad traffic. So we wanted to avoid that. 
And the parking lot we picked was expensive. Oh yeah, and the public parking that we parked to go on the boat ride was pricey. And we got, we had to pay per hour. So we, we paid two hours because one hour was the boat ride and like, we came a little bit earlier so that was like 30 minutes. And then 30 minutes we walked to the Midway boat to see it and the park right next to it and then the time it took us to walk from the parking to the harbor so yeah we paid two hours overall the boat ride was fun it was a nice view it was cold obviously because you're you know out in the ocean and there's a lot of breeze glad we brought jackets we were having fun we took some cool pictures uh, the prize for the boat ride we got it on Groupon so we got a, a deal for a two hour on um, tour and that's why we kind of just decided to leave early too because you know we got a discount with uh, Groupon but normally if you buy your tickets there at the place if you just show up it's 60 bucks each person which you know some of you guys might be like oh that's fine two hours you get to enjoy it you know if that's fine with you that's fine but we're glad we paid half of that and just got the experience and had fun just because you never know too like when you're going somewhere new you don't know if you're gonna like it if you're gonna hate it soul ships yeah we're gonna be in the car for two hours to go back to LA to visit our parents to pick up our baby boy Ash if I didn't tell you guys we brought Ash but he's staying at his grandma's house my husband's mom has taken care of him this whole weekend and we missed him so much he's our baby boy we were this is the first time that he has not slept with us and we were feeling so sad but he did so good yeah. she's yeah. been telling us how good he has been he's been a good boy which makes us really happy because you know in the future we're gonna have other trips where we're gonna be out of town we can't take him overnight and we like to know that he behaves good with other people because if he was a bad boy like they wouldn't want to take care of him and that would look bad on us yeah, like, yeah so i'm feeling like a proud mama i miss him so much i can't wait to to see him i feel like he's gonna be so excited he probably thinks we abandoned him poor boy so yeah um anything else the boat the park yeah that's pretty much it <laughs> i think that sums it all up um by the way i don't know if after this because like i said we're just gonna go celebrate with my sister her birthday i don't know if i'm gonna vlog too much after this but if i do i'm probably ali because ali likes to vlog so if she wants me to vlog a little i'll vlog if not um this will be the end of the vlog so yeah love you guys let me know down below um any questions that you guys have about the trip let me know also if you guys enjoyed the vlog and if you want to see more content like this because i had so much fun obviously you know this was a trip for our anniversary so thank god that you know we're still together a year after we very much love each other so yeah subscribe and like this video and i will see you guys in the next video love you guys bye like always thank you so much for watching my videos my loves and stay tuned there's more videos coming